Hi everyone, this is Joseph from Forest Tech Reviews, aka your favorite Cajun tech review. Back with another video today. Today's video is another quick tip. I like doing these type of videos. Hopefully y'all find them useful. Now in this one, I'm going to show you how to change your default keyboard if you don't know how to do that as of yet. But what we can do is the first step you really want to do is go into your Play Store and download whatever keyboard you like. There's many different ones in here. All I can recommend is make sure you, you get one from a site that is recommended, that has good reviews on it. I use two different ones, which is Gboard and SwiftKey. I can use Samsung's keyboard, which is, it's okay, but I just rather Gboard. Y'all let me know which keyboard you like to use in the comments. Basically, you download the keyboard you want. It doesn't matter which one you want. Just download it. The next thing I need you to do is go into your settings here. You want to go to device general management. Once you go to general management, you actually want to go to language and input. You can actually see they have different cup options here. You can go to default keyboard and it tells you which one is your default keyboard. Where you really want to go is under keyboards, unscreen keyboards. And this one will tell you you can manage your keyboards here. This part of the settings will allow you to pick which ones you want to download or which ones you want to see and you can actually go here and just highlight all of them now if you go back you go all the way back now if you hit default keyboard it has the other two that wasn't there before all you need to do is press which one you want to use i can just say gboard and now when i go to test something or type something I will have Gboard on there. Shout out to Team 100. And there is the Gboard keyboard. Not too hard. It's really easy to do. Now, when you are in the keyboard settings too, you can actually change how it looks and stuff. You can go into the settings here. You can change whatever keyboard you're going to use. You can change the theme if you wanted to for Gboard. I can make it red if I wanted to. And let's see, let's go keyboards. And then if I go back, and I go back in here, you have a red keyboard. It's definitely up to you on which way you want to go. I'm going to leave it as this one. Maybe I will put the outlines on there. But that is pretty much how you can change your keyboards. Again, it's really easy to do, not that hard. If you like this video and you learned something in it, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do so. Make sure you hit that notification bell. Also follow me on Twitter at Forest Reviews. Become part of the BAM Nation. And until next time, peace. I'm out of here. Y'all have a great day now.